Hi everybody! Hi everyone! So today we are going to a show jumping lesson with Danny and Annette Lewis but first we've got to have a little mini shout out to my little nephew Tommy who watches all my little videos. Morning, <laughs> so hi, Tommy. morning Tommy! Danny loves you! So we're going to Brook Farm, our local venue and I'm just going to fast forward to this morning Get in the tack and loading Danny. So we'll see you in a bit. I'm here in the tack room and I'm just going to grab Danny's tack. So for everyone waiting to see Danny's brown new tack, today's the day. So Danny's brown tack is all separate. We've been keeping it separate just for shows and they've been using Danny's, well, the saddle, Nebo saddle for Danny, but we've actually got a few little secondhand saddles just for out hacking. So I'm just going to get his saddle ready to go, making sure everything's ready. So in here I should have his bridle and everything. Yes, so I've got my bridle and my whip in there. So I've got that and then we've got his little grooming kit. But I've got everything to put together so it's nice and easy. So we'll pad up here. Right, so that's everything looks a bit dusty from when we got the walker out. So he's got that. Then what's up here? No, that's just white. Okay, right. So we've got his saddle pad, and then I've just got to choose a hat. But I might ride him in this hat today because I've actually got a navy hat and I think it looked lovely with his brown tack. Look how lovely that hat is. We actually bought this at the London International for Mum, but she never really wears it because she doesn't really want to wear it out happy. So, you're coming home with me. Everything is just dusty. Ugh, not the way I imagined it because we've had the walk out. Right, so let me go put this all in the barra. Then I've got my saddle and my air jacket. It's just popped everything in the barra. And now I'm going to wheel it all around. Just forgot my jelly as well. So, got numbers and jelly. which has got my girth attached to it yes I'm sure let's put all that in there and I've got my air jacket my hat my grooming kit that hat should have my jumping boots in and my titanium mask which I'm not too sure where my titanium mask is unless it's in my bridal bag let me have a look but my boots are in there just take a look I actually really like this bridal bag because you can hang it on the door I'm thinking it might be on the front yeah, we've got ears and hood. That's all there. That will be everything. So I've got bridle, saddle, girth, whip, titanium hood, um, numna, ears, grooming kit, boots, saddle, girth, jelly, stirrups. I think that's it. Let's go. Danny's all on board. Little boy. Let's go. Right, so we're back now and we're just on our way. So we should be there in around 10 minutes. It takes about 10, 15 minutes to get there. And then our, hopefully 
mum can pick up the vlog and film me doing some little attack up with Dan. And I know everyone, well, we'll everybody's been waiting. Today. Yeah, we have. And everyone's been waiting, mum, to see Danny in his new kit. Oh, he looks very hot. <laughs> so the moment has come and Mind you'll be you, able to see it not all. very coordinated today. She's got blue and brown on. No, I am colour coordinated. Blue goes with anything and so does brown. Mm. And Danny's got a blue saddle pad. Let's hear from everybody because I don't think blue and brown go. No, you know what? I'll tell you the truth. I put a brown <laughs> um, jumper on today and I thought, you know what? I'm being a bit too brown with the brown tag and now I'm going, really going for it. But I'm absolutely sweating and I've got to put a um, my Halo air jacket on. So and I'll also, take which is off. really exciting today, is Fifi is going to her favourite equestrian shop ever. So we're going to be heading to Wesley Saddery and if you do not know that I am kindly sponsored by Wesley's and I honestly love all their clothes. We'll show I'm literally you it all wearing, later. I can't really see it, but I'm wearing the lovely Dakota Brown set today and I know I'm sponsored by it so people might just say you know what you're just saying you like it but honestly how how like long have I worn <laughs> Wesley's and Dakota for as long as they've been doing Dakota you've worn it and it, I find it's the most comfortable and we do pay for our stuff as well <laughs> so we're going why are we going there today Fee? yeah so we're going there today because I want to buy some brand new De Niro boots so I'll be paying for them I know the only um, gifted items I get is my Dakota sets, which don't get me wrong, I am not complaining because I am absolutely obsessed with them. And so yeah, so I need to get some new De Niro boots because these ones are just, don't get me wrong, oh, they've got a bit of dust on them. They have served their purpose and I absolutely love them and they're so comfortable, but I use them for every day and hacking. Then I ended up walking around the yard in them so i need a new pair and also where i've changed all my tacks to brown i do want a sort of a brown glitzy pair for shows yeah and so she does get um a discount so she'll put the discount yeah so on. i'll be using the discount myself also so it's fifi 10 for 10 percent off so yeah check it out i'm just gonna open the gate because that is my duty love that. Good job. hello everybody so we've just arrived and Nettie's kindly let me borrow one of her bits. So it's the exact same as Danny's. It's just got that little curved bar in. So it just stops him basically being so strong. Because as soon as he goes outside, he just turns into some sort of racehorse and wants to gallop and everything. So I'm going to try that on him today. And then see if that's any good for him. And then I can buy him one. So I'm just going to quickly, while I've got time, attach it. Let me do my bridle. Now hopefully it'll be quite easy because... My bridle's pink, it's new. So I've just attached it using the clips and put the rubbers on. And I just find these Lemure bridles so much easier to unclip and clip on. Because especially if you're not one for, oh, I've got to dismantle my whole, whole bridle to get my bit off to clean it. You ain't got the excuse anymore. So I'm just attaching this. Let's get the pony off. But I call him a pony. Not exactly a pony. So. I actually travel Danny in his titanium hood because I just think it benefits the horse so well and I thought when I first sort of looked at him I did think oh this might just be a bit of a load of rubbish that people make up but oh my god it's been the best thing ever because he does get a little bit tense and stressful like the thought of loading but because he hasn't actually been out in a while before we I started training him so it just sort of keeps him calm. He, he acts like a little bit of a youngster, even though he isn't like 11. But I think it keeps him nice and calm. And also it's easy for me because I ride him in it anyway, so I don't need to worry. But it really helped me load him out because the other day when I was about to load him up, he was getting all fidgety and a bit anxious. And then as soon as I put the mask on, it sort of just mellowed him out. And they are, um, they're legal for uh, BS and everything like that, so you don't have to worry about that because it's not actually affecting the horse, it's just calming them. Good boy. Okay, so he has got a little issue going on there with lots of straw because he, he rubbed his head 
elephant sure. So let's get him packed up. He's ready. He's even like, though, when you think, I mean, we know how stressed Danny is, don't we? Yeah, he is. He's a real stress head. Yeah. And we took him Radley Green the other day when, obviously, I'm on him, okay, so he's probably more I stressed when I'm riding him. Yeah. But um, he, like, there's no one in this car park. Yeah. He's here completely on his own, and he's just standing there, such a good boy. He is really, he is a good boy. I find though when he goes out with Nebo, the pair of them together are worse. Yeah, I think, I don't know if anyone has a Welsh, but Welshes are quite highly strong and they're a little bit spooky and anxious themselves. So I think when he actually goes out with Nebo, he sort of plays off of his emotions as well. So they both stress each other out. Um, so yeah, you're going to see him in his new gear. All the gear and no idea. So this is his saddle. I'm not too sure if I've shown on the vlog yet, but this is his, well, I call it a new saddle for me, but I actually bought it second hand. So if you actually, it's not, a, it's not an ad, but definitely check out. There's an app called Vinted, not Vinted. There's an app called Equipped, which is so similar to Vinted, which you can actually buy horse items off of. So there's no difficulty trying to find horse items and this is a prestige isn't it yeah and honestly medium wide like this before we oiled it it literally <laughs> looks brand new now i've oiled it so this is a reminder to oil your saddles i'll have to go around the other side because the it sun's looks in lovely. that's better you can see the color yeah, now it's, it's had a really good oil but look at that color match with his linear um girth which i'm obsessed with if you're gonna if, um spend some money on a girth get that girth honestly it's so it's leather and it has a jelly feel um inside doesn't it filling yeah so it's literally but it's like so soft it's literally the best so let's pop that all on and also i've got his which i actually bought off of um facebook i'm very a second hand queen my free jumps because I've got so many free jumps that I'm not going out and buying them brand new because I've got too many and I need a brown because I'm now the brown queen so I'm just going to do his girth up which I can do up now because I've got the clip so with, I feel very posh and not normal <laughs> because I can now clip my martingale to my girth because they have these special little clips here so I don't have to wait to put his bridle on and masking gown before I put the girth on, which is so much easier. It's just a little like a nightmare. So yeah. So I just thread them through. I'm not gonna do it too tight first. I'll put it on three this side and keep going up. I won't do it too tight for now. I just tack him up and then tighten him at the end because I find they breathe out because I don't want you to do it up when they're just eating their hay. Hey? Travel boots. Pardon? Boots on, travel boots off. Yeah. So I actually keep my jumping boots in my groom bag. <laughs> Because I do not want to drop these on the floor because look how lovely they are. But they've got all fluff, so look at the floor, it's dirty. Put these on. And I did look at ones without the fluff, but Danny's a little bit of a sensitive boy and he wanted them fluffy. We had a good tip from the lady we met the other day at Radley Green, didn't we, for after show jumping she had that little cooler box yeah so she had an ice box and what she done is she buys all the exercise yeah she buys the little you get like little plastic cubes that you just freeze and then i've seen them everywhere yeah. it's more for like picnics isn't it yeah and picnic then, um, cubes she just got some ice boots oh don't look at his dirty white legs he got some we, she got some ice boots and then she just popped them on 20 minutes after her lesson and it just sort of cools the legs and then she comes to 
the normal boots on after 20 minutes in travel so yeah that's good I'm running out of hands to hold everything. Surprised we're actually on time. Normally, I feel so bad because I'm like trying to well, vlog learned, and it's in a rush. We've learned now you can't rush him. But no. Well, you can't rush me and you can't rush him. And if, if, you, if he doesn't have well, this little chill out before, yeah, it's a bit of a get, nightmare, he gets isn't a bit it? Stressed. So we've got to make sure now we're always early. Saddle fits in lovely, doesn't it? Right. A lovely bridle. A lovely bridle that I'm just going to try and without dropping it over. Um, Shall I hold that for you? Hold my bridle. Thank you. Right, so this is his new martingale and look how lovely the clips are on there super easy to do as well so, sorry but you're gonna have to stop eating for a minute so i get that last little bit yeah. Hold on. right uh, it has no clips to the saddle just sort of lays over the neck and then I just thread this through and then I've got a little clip under here that I literally just clip it through like that super easy and then I'm gonna put my um oh faint brains put my hat on well mum's hat that I've stole <laughs> With the caps though, you can buy different size liners, so she's got a smaller head than me, so you just change the liner inside. Does he just have front overage or back? Yeah, well? front.
moving. Collect. Eyes out. So hold him now. Good. Just don't be afraid to use your contact. That's it. Look at the jump. I don't care that he fusses. He's got to know that you've got him. He's a big, strong horse. Hold him. Wait. Wait. Good. That's it. Eyes up. Beautiful. No, no. Go left. Sorry. Wait. 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 Wait, 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 yes, good. Once more, because you're actually able to change the stride there. Okay, so we don't want to take everything away from him, but you have to know that sometimes you can make him listen. Yeah. Wait, perfect. Now just let him jump it, that's it, good. Okay, and stop. Did you enjoy that? Really well. You got lovely. 
You went lovely in the bit. Good boy, yeah. I Smash. We're in the car back from our lesson. Cutting mum out of the frame. I'm absolutely covered it in slobber from Dan because we give him this Saracen's um, recovery mash and it literally he gets it everywhere. He loves it. So I'm covered. You mix it with water. So you make half a bucket, like a few scoops of half a bucket of water and he like drinks all the water. Yeah, and so you've got all the bit of mineral, minerals in there. So literally it's been fantastic for mm. after comp our competitions or training. So she did fabulous today. Yeah, he, he jumped really lovely actually, especially in that new bit. I think I'd, I'd need to purchase that. He jumped really nice. So nice to see. I need a drink now. We've got a Lucozade in here. Oh, we've got a strawberry it. water. Oh, there's strawberry water, yeah. We well, yesterday. No, that's actually peach. It's really nice. Have we not got strawberry? No. Peach. But I'll have peach. some. Peach. very nice. We're back home now at the farm. And I've just popped down in his stable, gave him some hay. And I've just popped the other lot out in the field just because I'm going to give Danny a little rest just because obviously he has worked very hard today um, in his training session so I'm now on my way round to the tack room where mum has made me some lunch so that will be interesting to see what she's made me let's go but I am so excited so we're going to be heading to Wesley Saddery with some new boots <laughs> woohoo He's currently making some lunch. Um, we've had orders for tuna. Lovely. just popped it in Gatestone Saddery because I need a boot bag now so I have actually got a grooming kit and a bridal bag in the exact same so that's what I'm looking for these are all the brand new colors how lovely all these love the green and also look how nice this jacket is I like this because this goes with the bridal bags and boot bags and everything that I'm looking for they're really nice and this that set's really nice and I also liked these puffers obviously hopefully it start warming up but they've actually been discounted but really like them and socks I need socks these are nice I like a bit of green, me. What colour should I go for? Mum, what colour do you like? Green. What, the dark green or the light green? I like the light green. I don't know what size I'd be. Mm -hmm. Size. Yeah, four. Four to seven is a medium. And then... Oh, they're nice. They're plain, but they're, they're nice, these. Look. You don't Most of my joppers don't really have belts. And then this. This is what I need. And it's actually handy because you get like a big um, front pocket also for storage. 
Oh, for my actual short shoes. Right, okay. <laughs> I should, I should really get the hat bag to match. <laughs> I should really get the hat bag to match. For the navy hat, Mum. Should we get a hat bag to match for my navy one? I think I just want everything matching, you know? Excuse me in my wellies, they're not that dirty. The head collar section. And me and mum just noticed these ones actually in the sow up here. Which are really lovely because they've got the brown. So I picked one of them up and I can't seem to see all the lead rope. So I've just gone with like a gold. But I've gone with this colour. Then I picked up some wax for my boots because to clean them. So I've just left the farm and we're both knackered. <laughs> It's got a little man in the back. Hello. This is Tommy. Say hi. Say hi. Tommy, say hi. All right, I guess. He's got all shy. He's currently watching Alvin and the Chipmunks on the phone. But yeah, end this vlog here. It was quite a bit busy vlog. We went, we went on our lesson with Annette Lewis, which went really well, and Danny jumped lovely. Then we went to Wesley Saddery, where I picked up my new boots, and also I picked up this new um dakota set which you can see i'm wearing now with the blue which really looks lovely and we went ingate stone to get a boot bag so i've now got boots and i also got a hat bag and lots of other little bits so yeah and now we're in traffic waiting to drop little man off and get home ourselves so we're gonna go and see nanny first. yeah we're gonna go see my nan first as well so yeah don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and follow me on Instagram which is fifi's underscore welsh underscore ponies. Bye! Bye! Bye.